these are remarkable efforts and we are continuing to work and build out and that's what today is about. On Sunday, the B.C. government announced updates to B.C.'s 10-year cancer care action plan, including the introduction of chimeric antigen receptor T-cell therapy or CAR T-cell therapy. This is a treatment that trains a patient's own white cells to recognize and kill cancer cells. CAR T-cell therapy is an example of how far cancer treatments have evolved, driven by leading-edge, cutting-edge technology and research here in BC. The therapy will be made available to 25 patients affected by certain forms of leukemia and lymphoma per year. Previously, it wasn't readily available in the province. As science develops, we want to make sure that British Columbians have access to those treatments, certainly through clinical trials, but also through the healthcare system as a whole. Mary Jill Asrat is the parent of eight-year-old Hugo, a child who received CAR T cell therapy. She says the treatment significantly increased the odds of a successful bone marrow transplant. 13 days later, early in the morning while Hugo was still sleeping, our oncologist stepped into our room and he simply passed us a piece of paper which was Hugo's biopsy results. And in the corner, there was a little hand-drawn happy face. Hugo had no detectable trace of leukemia in his bone marrow. Through the 2024 budget, Premier Evie says the province will be investing $270 million over the next three years to offer better cancer treatments, including new clinics in Surrey and in Burnaby, as well as better access to cancer specialists in the province. Over 30,000 British Columbians were diagnosed with cancer last year, and this number will only continue to increase as our population grows and ages. Oncologist Dr. Kim Chi says the increase in services available to British Columbians, including self-screening programs for cervical cancer, will help save lives. When we increase awareness and make it easier to take part in screening, more people participate, more cancers are caught in their earliest stages and more people are cured. It doesn't matter who you are, cancer can touch your life. In Vancouver, Angela Bauer, City News.